Nittany Khan rolled into State College over the weekend at the Ramada Hotel, featuring vendors and comic book friends from around the region. It's actually only my second convention. Uh, my first one I did was Harrisburg Comic Con back in May, and it was a lot of fun. I was like, I really want to do this again, and I was like, oh, State College isn't that far away. It's been, it's been really fun. Like. I'm, I'm a people watcher, so this is like the next level people watching because I just love seeing the costumes and everybody's so enthusiastic. Not only are residents from State College here, but people from around Pennsylvania have come out to State College to see what Comic Con, also known as Nittany Con, has to offer. Thomas Range owns an online comic store. He told us his younger brother suffered an injury when they were kids, and an aunt bought him comics to help ease the pain. That launched his business. A lot of people coming in and saying, oh, you have this, oh, I need that, and I love it. Believe it or not, the customers here, they come with lists, and I, I, I guess it's because there are not too many shops around here. Like, if you're in Philly or New York City and you're in major cities, you can walk down the block and find four or five shops. Abby Kroll is a digital artist with a passion for drawing and dreams of getting published. My mom write, writes her, she wrote two books and she has another one coming out. She just has to get it published because we had to find a different publisher. Um, but I draw all the pictures in it. I illustrate the, uh, the cover of the books. Customers, business owners, and fans all coming together for some comic fun. In State College, I'm Andrea Smith for the Center County Report.